Hi, this is Rich Ramsey with You Never Die Entertainment, and today we're going to have a tutorial on how to add a social link above your HTML5 video player. Here we have a little social sharing button, and all it is is we got F Facebook, Twitter, and a close button. So, to start with, all we have to do is create a second identical web page in your server and add all your social sharing functions on that second page with a close button. I'll show you how to do this real quick. First off we need to find a page that we want to put some social sharing above our video. This looks like a good video. So we'll open up our text editor like Notepad. Find our web page This one's called Toot Screen, Toot for Tutorial. And all you do with the original first page at first is just copy it. Make an exact copy. Then you open up a new untitled page and paste everything in there. So, so far we have an identical web page and we need to add some social sharing functions. Now, when you go to Facebook or Twitter, they're going to give you a bunch of code to put in the the head or the body of the web page. So let's take care of that right now. This is just so the symbols show up and they can basically track your moves and do whatever they want to with the codes. So Twitter, they want one in the head. And Facebook, they want all this mumbo jumbo right below the body tag. So find the body tag, put the Facebook info in there. Now we simply take the, the, the actual Facebook and Twitter buttons and copy them right above our video tags. See, this is the beginning of the video, the end of the video. We want our buttons right on top of all that video language. And lastly, we need to find a close button that will send the person back to the original page. This is just simple coded button that when you push it, automatically sends the user back to the original page that they were on before. So, copy this. You can see the exact language for this button at standupcomedy.me backslash tutorials backslash HTML5 video. And paste it. So here on our first page, we have a close button. We have all our social sharing data set up. Now we just have to save it. We'll call it social. touchscreen and give it the HTML ending so we know it's a web browser file. Send that back and go to our original first web page that we have the video on that we want the social sharing on top of. Now all we do on the original web page with our video is we put a link underneath the video linking the people to the actual source tag. So I have a link pre-made right here on my cheat sheet. This is just simple HTML code. I wanted to make it simple. You could get fancy with some CSS. So we'll paste it. And we're going to link the people to the social touchscreen web page that we just created. And we're, call, we're going to call it social sharing. We're going to save that. Go to our file share. And upload both updated files into our web serving host. 
So find social toot screen right there. Put it in there. Go back to our page, hit refresh. And here you can see social sharing. We click on that link and Facebook and Twitter show up right above our video. And simply close it, hit the close button. Ah. So this is much better than having the buttons there and having all that code there in your web page. You can simply just have a link for it for social. Makes things much easier. So with that done, social sharing, you can always go to standupcomedy.me backslash tutorials backslash HTML5 video and learn how to do other things like add two player sizes. You can increase your player size, decrease your player size. Add a music player, which is pretty cool if you like music. But always make sure it's your music. We did the social link. You can add an embed link. Add a playlist, which is important if you want people to watch more than one of your videos. And switch from HD and SD. This is a crude form and it sends the video back to the beginning, but it works for now. And first and foremost, watch my film called Woggy. It's about a man that moves to Los Angeles seeking fame and fortune, but ends up wearing a dinosaur costume on Hollywood Boulevard, taking photos with tourists for cash donations. I think it's pretty funny. And just in closing, I'll show you this cool player that I made with HTML5 video, where I incorporated all of the functions that I just showed you. It's embeddable, and people just need to embed this player that can watch all of your videos instead of embedding a ton of your videos. They can just embed one player and watch all of your videos in one place. Pretty cool, huh? And in closing, I hope this helps you and have a great day. And just remember, if you know anybody that needs to help setting up a HTML5 video player, send them to my website. Thanks and have a great day.